With one remaining preseason game this Saturday, the Leafs are on the ice in Gravenhurst today. This trip is also about balance, team bonding, and on-ice conditioning. Yeah, we had a great uh, round of golf um, uh, yesterday. I think uh, uh, a little bit of a low-key afternoon. I think we got a dinner plan this evening. So um, obviously, just tremendous to be in the outdoors and uh, you know, a place I spend most of my off-season. So it's great to, to be back here at the time of year for, for me and to share with a lot of my teammates and. Um, yeah, just, you know, we know what the, the hustle and bustle is all about in the city and we love, uh, you know, the vibe around town and, and with the hockey season coming and uh, uh, what it's like in the city. But uh, no question, there's a tremendous community up here, uh, passionate about the game of hockey and obviously uh, very passionate about the Maple Leafs. So um, just great to be to be up here and enjoy uh, uh, what makes this place great. It's nice. Uh, it's really nice to get up here uh, you know, for a couple days. Uh, I mean, you guys follow us around everywhere, so <laughs> I, wouldn't com I wouldn't completely call it a getaway. But uh, <laughs> but it's nice. I've never been up to Muskoka before, so it's uh, you know it's a beautiful time of year right now up here. So uh, I think everybody's really enjoyed it so far. This isn't the first time the Buds have made the trip north just prior to the start of the season. Many camps have been held in Gravenhurst and Huntsville in the past. It's great, especially this time of the camp. You know, we're, we're at the, the point now where you're really starting to, despite the fact we have one more preseason game, you're shifting really into full preparation mode for the regular season. And uh, it comes a good time when you know, the guys the, the camp and preseason such starts to wear on the group a little bit because they just want to get on with it. Uh, so having this gap really worked nicely for us to fill it with uh, a chance to just get away and have the group be together. And it's obviously just one group here now, and, and that in itself brings the group closer. So uh, yesterday was a good day for us. Today we got lots of work done on the ice, and the guys have you know, put in great effort. Uh, beautiful weather, facility's been great. So it's, it's, it's really, uh, really been. Good experience so far. Although the practice was not open to the public, that didn't stop one young fan from taking the day off school to catch a glimpse of some of his favorite players. We got here, waited, waited about an hour. Some guy who works for the Leafs. Oh, you're not getting any autographs. Well, ended up getting four of them so far. Might get more hopefully. And it was a great day. Got autographs. Matthews, Tavares, Getzoff, and uh, head coach Sheldon. Did you, did you get a chance to talk to them at all? When they yeah, were yeah, I said hi. They, uh, they said hi. I asked Tavares how he's recovering. You know, me and Sheldon had a good talk. Asked him how he's going, asked him what he thought. I was, I was good. The Leafs take on Ottawa Saturday night in the final preseason game. The season starts for the Leafs Wednesday night when they take on the Habs. In Gravenhurst, Scott Acton, Kojiko News.